everyone. Thank you for watching my channel, Artful Creations by Rosie. I'm Rosie, and I just thought I'd show you a little uh, base pour today. Um, I've been doing this acrylic pour for a little while, and I'm just addicted, so I um, thought I'd share it with you. So um, this is my base. It's just a small one. On a little, put it on top of a little canvas, um, and I got this off another YouTube channel, so um, I just put it on a little cup to hold it up. Um, colors I'm using are uh, metallic, a metallic blue, um, metallic uh, cobalt blue, a magenta, a metallic gold, some black and white. So um, I'm just going to pour these in here and uh, we'll get started. <laughs> So I just kind of go around the edges first, um, just to make sure everything flows over. And then I just pour it down the middle. And let it go into the canvas so I actually get Two projects. So I'll probably let that sit for a while as it drips and it's, it'll continue to drip for a little bit. And then after it, I feel like it's sat for a few minutes, I'll uh, take it off and I'll um, continue with the uh, covering the canvas. Probably, I'm just gonna grab the cup down here and I could set it, let it set a little bit longer. It'll continue to flow, but we'll move it along here and let things kind of flow on the canvas. And then I'll just move this a little bit so we can get the sides and cover it good. Kind of pretty all the colors swirling together. I'm gonna actually do this to get the corners to cover a little better back down. Right amount of paint. Typically I tape underneath the bottom so I don't make such a mess on the back of the canvas. I did not do that on this one however, but that's okay. Kind of like these blue colors down at the bottom. Don't want to really lose all those because they're pretty so I'll try and Just kind of 
go back this way a little bit. Oops, touch the base there, but that'll fall over. We'll cover again. Oh, that's kind of pretty. I think I'll go this way just a little more. There, so, as a canvas, we'll let that set a little bit. I did put a little bit of silicone in there, so uh, I'm gonna grab my torch here. Maybe uh, we can get some of those to come through. See those cells coming up. I kind of like it. I think it makes it kind of cool when the other colors kind of pop through and oh, get close to the plastic. Yeah. And the vase. Wow. Turned out kind of cool. Kind of got a lot of black on it. The colors kind of float away, but the black and the blue actually looks kind of cool. I'm not sure how it looks from this, your side, but um, it looks pretty cool. So when things dry a little bit, I will uh, show you how it looks. But I just wanted you to get wanted to give you a good view of it. It's got some really pretty colors. I see the blue and the black. The other colors kind of disappeared, but I like the I like the blue and the black that's kind of coming through there. And there's the canvas. That one's still drying too. But 